Okay, right, guys, let me show you what we have to work on today. It's a uh, Challenger, man. I guess um, body shop didn't install it right. Look at that, man. That is crazy. By the looks of it, it looks like it's the OEM fender and it's just drilled holes and try to put that plastic. That's what it looks like, but if it's not an OEM fender, it's not gonna clip on properly. Uh, same thing with the other side. Look at that. Crazy. I mean, even bolts. That's a shame, man. They shouldn't be doing that. But uh, let me get that fixed and we'll see how it comes out. All right, guys. So, sucks that they did that, man. Literally, they tried to bolt it from the inside and they didn't do it right. So, sucks. But uh, tell me what you guys think. Um, I still got more to do. I still have to work around here. But look at that. Two. To that. Again, that is unacceptable, especially giving it to the customer like that. No way. So yes, yeah, definitely taking me more time. Um, so yeah, they basically use the OE. I'm not sure if this is an OEM fender flare or what. It's weird. But uh, yeah, they, they did use an OEM uh, fender and that's why they're having this issue. And then because the plastic inside is so thick, maybe because it's not an original uh, fender flare, maybe that's why we have like these big it's like this i tell you it's the plastic that's that's causing not to have a nice seal but but yeah we're we're getting there guys i'll let you know how it looks like once it's done so the, the, the i don't know if i can tell i don't know if this is oem or what but again i think this was causing it to not fully close because of the gaps yeah look at that and the fact that had glue i had to take it all off man so my advice don't use the oem if these are oem fender flares don't use them with the with the stock ones because man it is not coming out real good you just have to go with the aftermarket you get a better fitment uh, if you want it to clip on get the original uh oem uh wide body fender flares or fenders matter of fact look at this i don't know if you guys can tell god damn it it's so hard for you to Yeah, but I can see it. And you see that black that you're seeing? That's basically the, the brackets that I'm telling you about. You see that? No matter how much I press, it's not going in there. Hey guys, you tell me, you be the judge. What do you guys think? Like I said, when you do the OEM, you're never gonna get a complete seal. That wasn't me, by the way. But yeah, look at that, guys. What is your thought, man? Leave your comments below. Let me know what you guys think. Like I said, they should have done this from the beginning compared to, compared to that. Look at that, no matter how much I press, look at that, guys. No way. And for the people that don't believe that you're getting this thing bolted on, well, let's see if we can prove you wrong, guys. Let me know what is that? Bolt on, bolt on, bolt on. So, bolt it on, guys. We don't play here when it comes to your white body. We don't want this thing falling off. So, so now it's uh, the next one. So, check it out, guys. I'm gonna apply pressure here and watch how this thing's not gonna close. Look, you see it? I'm putting so much pressure, nothing. Absolutely, you're never gonna get that perfect uh, close unless you press it like on the really, really top. You see that? Man. Definitely uh, go after market. Don't go with the OEM unless you're gonna get OEM uh, wide body fenders as well. All right, guys, so update. Again, if you think two sided tape is gonna save your life, man. You guys better rethink that because again we don't use two-sided tape man if we do it's maybe just for the corners but you can't do it with the after uh the the factory uh fender flare again look at that man 
this stuff come on man i don't know why people think that's gonna be perfect for your wife but you have to bolt that thing on man now i gotta take this thing off and trust me i found a way to remove this but man if you were to do hand by hand look at this Ooh, take forever Whoever decide to put bolts, shame on you, bro. Shame, shame, shame. All right, guys, car is ready. Again, check it out. We got the bolts removed over there because they came with them. Again, I don't know whose idea was to drill uh, bolts, but man, they destroyed that. Uh, it could be fixed, just a little bit of bondo, a little bit of paint, you'll, you'll get rid of it. Just because it's matte black. Uh, fenders, uh, fender flares, look at that guys. Way better. Again, you're not going to get a 100% just because I told you. Because they're OEM and I, I guess because they have the plastic in the back, they can't really come together. Uh, because again, they're not OEM uh, wide body uh, fenders. Uh, same thing with the other side. Again, way better than what it was. Like I said, I keep pressing. And it's just, look at that, I'm pressing, I just can't get rid of that gap. And that's because of the plastic that's inside. If it was the Vicrest one, that thing would have been perfect. Uh, but I guess this is what we get to work with. Um, let me know what you guys think. Again, we tried our best to get that solved. Uh, same thing here. They destroy the bolt. We put it back in there again. Um, so that's closed compared to the uh, when it was when they brought it same thing here good to go um, but yeah guys oh uh, still a thing whoever uh, whoever painted it painted it here and it just looked really really bad so I try to get as close as possible try to get rid of the paint that way it looks like it's one piece and not two pieces but overall guys it is good to go again uh, leave your comment below let me know what you guys think did we kill it or not?